And hello, shop fans. This is your beloved soldier of the inverted cross, Rip the Full Blown Freak Show, here for another Rip's Random Reviews. And today we'll be having a look at the uh, Toys R Us exclusive Star Wars Black Series Hover Tank Pilot. Um, now, I, I love unique looking stormtroopers. If you've seen my Crimson Stormtrooper review, you know that. I just love, like, the different looking ones, and I just love this helmet. That's why I picked this up on eBay. Uh, it literally just came in the mail today. I got it for like 12 bucks, which is a very good deal. Um, the helmet, like I said, I just, I love this weird design. Um, I believe the Scarif Trooper uses some of this armor. I can't remember if it uses the helmet. Um, yeah, everything looks really good. These olive colored pants, the, uh, dirt, like paint apps on them. Like you can see it really well in some spots here on the head. Like, he's not just a stark white figure. And I really like that about him. Uh, really, really nice figure. Um, as far as accessories, he just comes with this pistol with no way to store it on him, I don't believe. But he can hold it in his trigger finger there. And for scale, uh, I'll go and show him off with some other figures I'll be reviewing today. Here's Black Series Ahsoka Tano. If I can get her to stand. And another figure I'll be reviewing today, the uh, GameStop exclusive Inferno Squad Agent. So, yeah, he's a pretty nice built figure. As far as articulation goes, and again, I just want to say, I just love this armor. It looks so beautifully done. Just so much nice detail. Uh, his head can rotate left and right. It's a little bit of a pivot. He can look down very far, up pretty decent. He has a ab crunch that goes pretty far forward, pretty far back. You can also get a bit of a lean out of a pretty good lean. He also, it's kind of tight. I need to heat mine up, but he can use that as a swivel. And then the shoulders do the thing I wish all the stormtroopers did where the uh, armor just goes up under where you can get full horizontal movement. Uh, and then, you know, you can rotate them. No problems there. Swivel in the uh, elbow joint here. And the elbow actually bends, I'll do it on this hand as well, pretty decent, but naughty. So I can't complain about that. Swivels in each wrist. Uh, he has a hinge in this one. It's a little bit limited. And then in this one, he has to hinge the roll of the dice motion, which makes wielding his gun a little bit uh, more realistic, I believe. And then for the legs, he can kick forward very far. These uh, soft bits don't really get in the way of anything. Uh, he can go out about this far, so not very far on that movement. movement not very far back. There's a swivel in the thigh. Double-jointed knees. Uh, feet can, can't really move forward a lot due to the sculpt here. They can move back fairly decent. And then they have ankle pivot. Now, is this guy worth the pickup? Um, if you're only after him, like, because I don't think there's a hover tank yet for him to, like, be, you know, to display him in. But if you're like me and you love... Just unique looking stormtroopers. Then this guy's totally worth a pickup. I absolutely love this figure. Probably my favorite stormtrooper I've gotten. Uh, or I know he's a hover tank pilot. But just trooper in general. I really like him. And I'm really glad I picked one up. Um, I, I was going to pick him up the day I saw him at Toys R Us. But I bought the uh, Kratos, NECA Kratos instead. But... Yeah, this guy is definitely worth the pickup. The paint apps are amazing. The articulation is wonderful. Um, I'm going to have some fun taking photos of this guy. Be sure you check on the main page um, uh, of my channel for my Instagram account because there will be some photos of this guy going up. Uh, he is absolutely awesome. And until next time, this has been your beloved soldier of the inverted cross, Rip the Full Blown Freak Show, a.k.a. The Gold Member. Signing off. Farewell.